Let's hear from our staff pioneers who came to this campus 10 years ago. You know, it's a home away from home. It's, you're here and you're, it's an extension of what it is that we do. I guess something here that's attracting me, this has became home away from home. That it is a home away from home now. It has become a place where people can call, you know, their second home. I remember when it was still basically the base and a few wires going up and Alan looked at me and said, well, that's where your office is going to be. It was several weeks of packing and sorting and tagging and labeling. Just being in the trailer and selling our first membership before our membership pre-sale office opened, um, member it vividly. I actually started a couple months before the JCC officially opened. Um, so when I first got here, there was no equipment here whatsoever. So initially what we did was just wait and room orientation. We uh, didn't have the client base. We didn't have the, the number of employees here. We didn't have as many families. So it was super easy. Within a month, everybody wanted to be here because they knew it was here and it was open. And then things started to change. And what I remember that um, was very challenging in the very beginning to understand that you don't know every single person on the campus anymore. You don't know every single employee. Um, you need to introduce yourself and you need to be able to welcome people who are coming. I remember having to write everyone's information down on paper and we didn't have couches or carpet or... So we're learning every day as we go, just kind of winging it. Just acting like we knew exactly what we were doing, but we did not. But it worked. Going back to those days, not having anything tangible, um, not really having a staff or a team or programming, it was a challenge. It was, and at the end of the day, it just turned out phenomenal. I think from what we uh, promised up front, we definitely delivered upon and we're still going and there's no stopping inside. I recall once, yeah, we had our group fitness director at the time, Michelle, and I had a small car, a small Acura, and I had to run out and get trash cans for the, for the facility. So I went into Home Depot and bought as many trash cans as I could fit into my car, not thinking to myself, oh, but there needs to be room for Michelle in my car too. So it turns out, yes, uh, Michelle is hidden under 10 to 12 garbage cans in my car trying to squeeze in so we could get back to the club. The lady called me around a Passover time and said, is this Jewish Community Center? Yes, ma'am. You know, I'd like to have a Jewish baby. I said, well, how can I help you? She says, you don't understand what I'm talking about, do you? Isn't the Jewish Community Center? I said, ma'am, this is cultural center. It's not a clinic. So we don't help or provide any material for Jewish babies here. She goes, fine. Can you at least give me a matzo ball soup recipe? I have this community as a model of American community. There are a lot of things to learn about here. Yom Atzma'ut, eh, even Yom Kippur, bring so many opportunities for so many people to come and celebrate together. Again, we can see the collaboration between all the departments. I think this campus has turned into an incredible multi-generational place. Um, I'm glad that uh, we have all been part of it. We met at the JCC, so I think I hit the jackpot and I hope Mila feels the I same feel way. I feel the same way. Talk to me about this friendship. Boy, well, we yeah. go back 10 years now. Right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, I, as Ed was talking about his interview, I remember when he came in in that black suit and <laughs> not feeling well, I'm like, all right. Alan made it almost mandatory that each of us had to work at least two hours at the fitness center to get to know what they are doing and get mm -hmm. to know their jobs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they still tell some of those stories from those days when they had all the different department heads up at the front desk trying to help but really, let's be honest, probably getting in the way more than actually helping. Yeah. Um, there were no help at all, in fact. I love the fact that we keep trying to make members and client experiences the best possible. Meet a lot of celebrities, um, Sammy Davis Jr., Dean Martin, you know, Frank Sinatra, the whole Rat Pack. Here, it's just one, like I said, it's like a family to me when people come in. Even if you come in for one day to use it, or you come in for 10 years, you know, you're still part of the, the family. You all are rock stars here. That's why I give everybody their high fives. That's the one thing that I hope will never change, is that sense of family that we all share. Yeah, I think it, the community of me, <clears throat> you guys are my family. Are you gonna like, cry? I, no, I'm not gonna cry. <laughs> cries I always cry, it's okay, but I'm not cry. gonna cry. We'll cry later. I'm not gonna cry. Yeah. I have made all my friends from here from parents that were in my classroom to co-teachers, co-workers, like 
ninety percent of my friendships come yeah. from working yeah. here. So it's, true. it's just a welcoming place, and for me, it's where I feel the most connected. But really, I feel like it is such a visionary place that there's only great things to be to be had. Totally confident that our leadership will bring us in the right direction in terms of change and moving forward at the Chase's view. I think um, the diversity that we have on staff today is for me like the biggest thing. Our, our staff, even though they're so ethnically diverse, um, have, have grown to embrace the Jewish values that I think are just universal, universal values. While I've, I've been uh, with JCC Community Center from there to here, I raised two kids. They are grown up, got married, and they gave me uh, one granddaughter, one grandson. So I'm very happy now. <laughs> we have had a great 10 years here at the JCC, and I expect the next 10, 20, 50 years to be only better. Happy birthday, JCC, and thank you for being a part of my life and my family's life for so many years. Well, I love the JCC, like I said, and, and I love uh, all, of, all, all of us as a family. Happy birthday. All of JCC live fully. I have a Gamzula Tova oh, for you. Yes. Things work out the way they are meant to be. Nice.